Why, hello there, friends. Seth of the Sega LPs here. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing fine. This is Kirby's Return to Dreamland. In this episode, I guess we are taking a bite out of the dangerous dinner. As controversial as that may seem, I don't know. It doesn't seem like a very good idea, but alas, I've, I've seen I've seen Kirby's stomach go through quite a bit, so I don't think it's going to bother him all that much. Anyways, we leave the... Someone pointed that out to me. I, I don't really notice the music much in these games, because I find that just talking over the game audio just kind of makes it hard to listen to it. So if I don't already know the song is good, chances are I'm never going to hear it, which kind of it kind of sucks, but whatever. But I must say, I, I did take some time to listen to it, and that was quite the song right there, out there, in the actual hub world of the Dangerous Dinner. We may be a dangerous dinner, but at least they invited some great musicians, if you know what I'm saying. Regardless, I don't know what I'm doing. Why am I going backwards? I, w I was just talking yesterday about how counterintuitive it is to go backwards in a side-scroller game like this. But, alas, I decided to do it because Kirby, well, because Kirby was looking at me funny, that's why. Because he's trying to spear me in the face and I was having to run away from him, even though Kirby's the one who was running away in the end because I was making Kirby run away. And this does not, does not really help my case. This just only makes me sound more crazy. So we, we, will, try, we will try to salvage some sanity here by not standing on blocks that are going to explode. This... Man, that lava. Why? Okay, so these are basically the lava enemies in uh, that 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 one game. I have trouble thinking of the name of the game sometimes. It, it, it I, I want to say a Kirby game. Apparently, Yoshi and Kirby are the same thing. I was talking about the Kirby game. It's, bas it's basically those giant lava pillars, except they don't have faces in this game, and they uh, went on a diet because they're skinny. They're a bit skinnier than the ones in. These birds are, are freaking annoying. So I'm gonna kill them. I'm gonna kill this guy by poking him in the eye. Haha, -ha, poked in the eye. Poke. My, uh, I, was, I was gonna make a. Po I was gonna make a very, very silly Pokemon joke, but then the flame pillar just had to ruin it, just because, just because he he doesn't like how he's always on a diet and he doesn't like his diet and he doesn't like being super. <gasps> Another Indiana Jones part. Wait, what, what? What does it usually mean when it's an Indiana Jones part? Do I have to? Do I have to go fast? Do I have to go behind? I guess going behind the boulder is always a great idea. Behind the boulder. Whoa! Okay, maybe it's not always the best idea. But if you can jump, I guess it can't be that bad. Uh, sh they do deal a lot of damage, though. I'm not even sure if I could survive going behind the boulder once again. I'm gonna have to float, over, float on above this guy. At least I get a max tomato. Okay, so I probably could have gotten hit by it. How do you... How do you... How do you not get hit by it? That's actually that actually really bothers me. I actually don't know how. Regardless, I'm sure one of these. Oh boy, there is a key, which means you gotta grab this key. Keep running, keep running, Kirby. No, no, no. Did I just kick him? Kirby jumped and kicked him in the face. Wow, that's awesome. Kirby, sometimes you can be a pretty cool guy, in a weird, mean, sadistic sort of way. No, I wanted to get the one-up first. My life is ruined, and now I got the energy sphere before the one-up. The natural order of things is broken. Or is it? I don't know what the natural order of things would be. In this, especially especially in Dreamland. I mean, Dreamland doesn't seem to have much order at all. I mean, other than... I guess Meta Knight is the guy who preserves the peace in Dreamland. Why am I doing fire against water? This is not good logic in... I would say this is not good Pokemon logic, but then again, just elemental logic in general seems to contradict the fact that water could be bad against fire. Regardless, apparently, it actually does seem... Uh, I wonder if there is actually a factor in of the ineptitude of fire versus water, because we don't seem to be dealing a ton of damage with this fire ability. Regardless, apparently if you throw it in the form of a star, solar energy, well, solar energy evaporates water. So I guess you could say that. You could say it's got that going for it. So let's just use his solar energy, and by that I mean stars, to get him on his merry way into, I don't know, the afterlife of Water Galboro. So I wonder what that must be like. Maybe they just get transported into the Water World world. I mean, that's, a, that's a movie, right? There, there was a show, something like Water World or something. Oh, hey, you actually need the water ability to get... Well, I guess you don't. You could use the float ability to get there. But if you want to get there with a the key, I do recommend using the water surf ability. Because surfing is cool! Yes, that is definitely the only valid reason. Alright, so what you're going to want to do here... Alright. Alright. Um. Da darn it! It's not... No! No! 
Okay, okay, water Gullboro, dude. I, I need I need your I, your services are required here. You better you better respawn. You better respawn. Come on, come on, water watery watery Golby. Golby. That's that's his name now. Golby. It's like Dolby Audio, but with a G instead. Come on, come on, Golby. No, no. Well, it appears our good friend Goldie couldn't be bothered to resuscitate for us, and so we are going to have to come back all the way off screen and kill him again, because apparently this is just an inopportune time for his resuscitation. Yes, we, we have to get to the big star door at the end and break him out of heaven. That's, that's, that's basically what it is at the end of the day, because we are kind of going into a heaven-like area every time we win a level with those cloud jumping games and everything. Yes, this is our mission. We must break our good friend Goldie out of heaven. We're the ones who killed him, so I guess we feel guilty for that or something? I don't know. Regardless, we are going to redeem ourselves in that sense and eventually do that. But right now, I'm more concerned about breaking all these blocks because you never know when an energy sphere could be hiding. What is that? It looks kind of like the eels in the water level, but it's not an eel. Well, I don't think that's an eel. Last I checked, eels didn't thrive in the lava environment. Regardless, I do like Indiana Jones Kirby, but I think that Tornado Kirby is going to be a bit more useful in getting past all these eels. Kind of is. Tornado Kirby is useful at everything. I think Tornado Kirby is useful at everything. Holy crap, I'm not dead. I am not, I'm not dead. I'm not, I'm not dead. See, I'm not dead. See, I, I never lie to you guys. Never, never. Anyways, we are going to continue over here. Break this bird. Continue breaking through the walls of lava because we can and hitting whoa holy, holy geez that guy that guy almost ate me i think Kur kirby doesn't like being on that end of the food chain regardless oh, okay okay we got it really kirby really that, that that was the best use of your tornado powers ever i am glad that we see eye to eye on how to well use tornado powers well, I guess there is no real book on how to use tornado powers. I, I don't know how many people have ever gotten tornado powers. Hmm. Uh, you don't want to step on that one. All right, yes, yeah, so I guess we got to make sure that this guy... Okay, we don't want to step on that one. I get the feeling that that makes a thing appear. What does it do? What is, what is this stuff? Okay. I don't get it. What? Let's see. Let's let's see. Okay, okay, let's do this. Okay, so he runs over there. We we did that. We don't want to break that because or else he falls into the spike. Here he jumps over it, so yes, you need the blocks to make him jump over. So the fact that there was a block there probably kinda means he's dead. And, well, Kirby logic kind of dictates that we wanted him dead, but, of course, we did not want him dead because he had something of ours, and therefore we need to retrieve it. What? You cannot do this to me! No. Okay, this, that's two energy spheres. Two of them that I have to go back and do off-screen. Man, this game, this game's cruel to me, guys. Cruel. Utterly cruel. Oh boy, this guy. Let me guess. You're gonna you're gonna spontaneously dissipate as soon as I try to suck you up. Oh, okay. Actually, actually didn't. <laughs> I only have. I could I could have three energy spheres right now, but I don't. All right, we're turning into Ice Bowl Kirby. We all know that this is the best Kirby. Actually, this is one of the most fun, in my opinion. And definitely one of the most fun to use. Da -da 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 -da! We destroyed all the bowling pins. We are therefore the bowling champion of the world. At least when it comes to being a basic. Being an ice cream cone, yeah. That's basically what Kirby is at the end of the day, if you look at it. Look, he's an ice cream cone. That's what he is. Look at him. He looks like he came right off the Dairy Queen menu. Fabulous. I don't know if Dairy Queen is a thing anywhere but Canada. I guess you're going to want to go back here. Woo! Bam! I mean, what did that do other than save you the trouble of trampling those guys with your ability, basically? Absolutely nothing. I didn't have to, I, I didn't have to go through there. A lot of trouble for nothing, anyways. Um, okay, but this is not. Th these are bowling pins, and we we have a ch we have a championship title to uphold, guys. We need to make sure these bowling pins die. Just like bam. What did we get? Cake. 
All right, cake, cake, cake is a good prize. You never know when it's gonna be a lie or when it isn't, so might as well, might as well take it when you can get it. Kirby, let's see, what else do we have here? We have, uh, boom. That's what I say to this ladder. You might say I'm climbing the ladder in the rankings of bowling champion. Ha, Whee! boom. I am a snowball. Okay, so you want to, ta-da, become, well, freeze the mountain. Okay, this is the Legend of Zelda, and we just got the ice arrows, so now we got to go get the gauntlets of whatever. I believe that's what's it. It's, it regardless, that's kind of like spoilers if you've never played that game, but you probably don't know which game I'm talking about if you've never played it, so it's okay. Didn't do, it didn't do too much harm right there. Oh, crap. All right, there we go. So, this is the void stage again. <sighs> Well, at least we know that there is a Sphere Doomer here. That is two energy spheres, which means that the only ones left unaccounted for are the ones that we so stupidly left behind. And by stupidly, I mean, well, there's not much we could have done, but I guess there was. I'm just gonna go under the cannon because that is the logical way to do go about things. Uh, okay, you can also destroy that bomb block if you have something to destroy it with, I suppose. Okay, we need to push that back, but at this point, it's probably better to use this and shoot at the cannon so that we can get that cannon down. We can head up here, and incidentally, these cannons are going to try to kill us! Well, they're cannons. What else would they do? I, I don't know. I've, ne I've never seen a cannon trying to save someone's life. Regardless, we are going to destroy this guy and become a cannon in, our in, a in and of ourselves in a way. We are cannons. That is an ice elemental cannon. I don't remember seeing any of those. I guess we probably saw that in the ice level, it would make sense, but we're, oh yeah, I actually now kind of think about it. What, what is going on? What? What? Oh, okay, I get it, I, I get it. I was this close to just make just dying in the most ridiculous way possible. Don't shoot! Okay, there we go. Didn't shoot. Um, okay, we can, we can chill under here eating our piece of meat, our assorted meats, while we wait for this. <laughs> okay, well, let's wait for this to go by the wall. Oh! Oh, crap! Okay, we, we can still do this. 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 All right, I guess you can, you can make a choice. You can either use it to get through there faster. <gasps> Whoa! Holy crap! Holy, holy, oh, what? Yeah, made it! What now, wall? What now? Nothing. You can't get to me in this room. For some reason. Why didn't the wall... I mean, we're still in the same realm, technically. Why can't it? Why can't it just bleed through into this this perspective of the? <laughs> really? Really? Why? Why? Someone, ex I'm actually curious. I'm gonna use you guys' as trick. I call it you guys' as trick because you guys kept suggesting this to me early on in the let's play. Just by. <laughs> He's. Oh. Up upon swallowing sleep. Oh, amazing! That's the best ability. And shake Wii Remote or move in random directions. Early wake up. Oh, this the, I love this guy's abilities. They're they're really my kind of abilities. Regardless, I guess we are going to have to take this because the other option is quite inadequate in this particular scenario. Oh, what? There's a cannon here. This guy's a cannon guy. Well, I guess he is. He he does kind of shoot cannonballs. Look at those silver cannonballs. Yeah, I get the feeling that this is a really good ability to have against these three because, well, their cannonballs ain't nothing against my tornado whip. Tornado whip. Yes, this is quite something. Quite, quite a technique. That uh, I guess Kirby is really, really. A, he has an adeptitude. Adeptitude. Is that even a word? I don't know. Anti ineptitude. That's even less of a word. But regardless, he, he has some kind of affinity. That's what I was looking for. An affinity to anything tornado. Kind of a wind. He's a wind bender. He's an airbender. He, Kirby is the real last airbender. Not not that fake stuff. Not that fake stuff you see on TV. Wait, this is technically on a TV, even though you guys are probably going to be watching it on a monitor. Regardless, I don't know this. Enough of that analogy. Right now, we're going to have to try not to die. Actually, what? Why did I get? This guy gives you ice ability. Boom! And he blocked it with his little spear. Spear Doomer. More like Spear Saver. They save him. Oh, maybe. Okay, there we go. He's done. Oh crap, that, that, that thing is gonna try to shoot me while I'm getting my energy spheres. 
Oh, come on. Don't, don't, don't pretend like you don't exist anymore now that I killed your master. I know you're still there trying to pick me off. Tick me off, more like it, because it's not showing up. Hey, I'm a bit uncentered there. Awesome. Well, we got those energy spheres, guys. And we all know where the other energy spheres are. Alas, I did not... Did not do a very good job at getting them, but regardless, we are going to have to make do with these spear cams for now, and head out onto the... Oh, we're not... I, uh, for some reason, I keep thinking that the levels are going to finish as soon as we go through that star, but this is the star door that really ends it. So, let's go save our good buddy, Mr. Galdi from heaven. This doesn't look like heaven. This looks more like hell now. With, oh, look, we, we made it to the sky. We made it out of hell. I don't know, it was pretty fiery down there, but we did get number one, and I guess number one makes you, I don't know, free spot in heaven. Yay! I don't know. But by the looks of it, Kirby would have quite a, kind of a tough spot getting to heaven any other way. Oh, what, a, what a crazy sadist he is. Regardless, we are going to... I don't know. I guess I'll just head back in here and see you guys out here with all the energy spheres because we are greedy on top of all our other sins. Kirby, you are... Kirby's a sinner. A major sinner. No. No. Get out. Get out. Whatever. You can be an extra. Whatever. A cameo appearance. Uh, you're, you're a mime, though. You're a mute. You're a mute in this video, okay? So do 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 mimey things. Alrighty then. All the energy spheres are now. I forget. That took me like 20 minutes to do. I forgot what I was even saying before I went into that door. Regardless, I'm going to have to leave you guys to to. I don't know. Until until stage two. I'll be back soon with some more Kirby. With some more. Some more. That is, that is incredibly distracting miming. Anyways, I am going to. That I, I I got I got nothing. I got nothing. It's just just listen. I know I know this is physically impossible, but just listen to the miming. It will it will conclude the video for me. 